will be a real short update on my building the Black Pearl. I've made a major breakthrough on making a sale. So let me show you what it looks like and I'll show you how I made it. You may recall that I had mentioned that I was considering using landscape fabric. This is the least expensive or the thinnest landscape fabric to make my sails. And I mentioned sanding them down to make them look aged. And I've been working on it. I've developed a little better and safer way to do it. I just took a piece of, oh, this would be like a, a, a closet rod or a very large dowel piece that was left over. Wrapped the sandpaper around it, stapled it, and now I'm able to lightly shred and I just keep turning the, the sail over and just lightly keep wearing down each side. So let me show you close up how I'm doing that. Okay, let me put a paper towel under it so you can see how it's starting to shred. So you can clearly see how I've worn some holes in it. The edges are starting to fray. And it's just personal taste. I'm going to shred quite a bit. And, you know, it may vary sale to sale, but that'll make it kind of unique. They're going to be somewhat transparent anyway, and they're going to be very flowing. So let me continue working. I'll show you one when it's complete. But so far it, it is still looking promising. I have no guides for how to do the sails. I just measured the distance and then uh, plotted it out on a piece of paper and then cut this out. The next thing I did was uh, took some just white glue and watered it down quite a bit, then put my sail into that mixture, then uh, rang it out and got as much of the moisture out of it. I uh, taped these two styrofoam cups together. In the future I'm going to use plastic. But anyway, tape those together. And after I got this moistened with the water and glue mixture, I let it dry on there. It gives me a little bit of a puffed out appearance. I think you can tell if I hold it like this. And then while it was on those cups, I also went along and just right along the edge would put a very small dab of super glue and then just slowly work my way out to fasten a line to it. So let's see what that will look like on the ship. This is my first attempt of making one of the sails in the pattern that I had mentioned earlier. It's not officially attached. This is just temporary. But I think you can get the idea of what I'm striving for. I think it'll actually look better without the blue background. I'm just doing that so you can see what I'm trying to reach. And I probably won't do all the sails unfurled, just some, and then some I'll have rolled up partially. <laughs>